Hello once again, friends, and welcome to today's Canes Camp Report brought to you by McDonald's. The Hurricanes enter the second week of training camp with a lot of passion and intensity. Our focus today is going to be on the offense, in particular the running backs, where there is a lot of depth of running back, and that position is spearheaded by junior Travis Homer, who is having an outstanding training camp. We're now joined by University of Miami running back Travis Homer, and Travis, you're having an outstanding camp so far. Why is it going so well for you? I think it's just the competition that everyone brings in the room. It's really just forcing us to push each other to our limits. Let's talk about some of that competition and the young players that you have. There's a lot of competition at the running back position this year, isn't there? Yes, yeah, the, indeed. With uh, Camelot coming in, you know, they're still young. They got to learn a little bit more of the plays. But as soon as they get that down, they're going to be really good. Like, I mean, really good. Why has this been so important to you? Ever since you took over running back for Mark Walton, you can see the determination that you play with. Why is that so important to you? Uh, probably just because I love the game, you know. I like to see everyone doing good. It just excites me. Along the lines of loving the game, when you come out here to practice, you're with your teammates. What do you love the most? I'd probably say when we make a big play and you just turn around, you see everyone all excited. You are a guy that does not go down easy. Why is that important to you? I don't, I don't like getting dirty. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, uh, like to, you like to stay in bounds. Yeah. Yeah, uh, Coach Brown, he emphasizes that a lot. You know, it's just helping us be uh, tougher players. How about this offense this year? A lot of weapons. Why do you think it can be an explosive offense? What do you see? You know, we got a lot of speed out of the wide receiver position, even in the backfield. Uh, the line, the linemen are getting stronger and faster, and Malik and all the quarterbacks, they're really getting their accuracy down. You go against a difficult defense every day. What's the toughest part of playing against your defense? Speed and physicality, because no matter what, they're going to bring it every day. The offense, the running game behind the offensive line, what have you seen there so far? I've seen a lot of gaps that are opening up, and if we keep this up, I think we're going to have a real good season. You had a couple of guys move around. You ran behind Big Navon last year, right guard, yeah. pushed out the tackle. He's still big to run behind, isn't he? Yeah, of course. Let's talk about the success you had a year ago, over 900 yards, nine touchdowns. I mean, it's just what happened when you play the game, okay, trusting you your, trust your offense. When you score those touchdowns, take it, through, take me through it now. The Kamea Mea, <laughs> the Dragon Ball. Yeah, uh, that's a signature move of Goku, yeah. and you know, just a lot of respect for him. So I had to show my respect. Let all my anime lovers out there know that I watch it too. We actually, uh, at the camp, we yeah. get on the PlayStation. We they have a game. You know, I gotta give the hands to a couple people. Are, are you the champion? For sure. We look forward to seeing that dance this year. <laughs> yes, sir. Expect the Canes running game to be solid with Travis Homer leading the way and a strong supporting cast. That's today's Canes Camp Report brought to you by McDonald's. I'm Joe Zagacki. We'll see you next time right here on HurricaneSports.com.